Hey there, I'm looking for a new Cold War weapon. What do you got? Oh, hey, I got the perfect gun for you. Let me go get it. Check this out. It's Mac 10. Very fast fire rate, decent recoil, nearly the perfect SMG. Try it out. Nice, it's very well rounded. Although, I feel like there's not enough grip on the gun. Okay, what kind of handle do you want? Handle? Nah, just slap on some duct tape and it should be good to go. Duct tape? That seems kind of lazy, don't you think? Yeah, you can thank the developers for that. Let me go add that on. All right, it's all wrapped in duct tape and ready to go. Eh, I don't like the feel of this duct tape. What do you mean? It's all the same duct tape. It doesn't make a difference. Oh, I know. You need to wrap it with some rubber bands. This is a gun shop. I can replace any part of this gun for you, and all you're asking for is duct tape and rubber bands? Why did Activision have to get so lazy with attachments for Cold War? You know, you really could have just done this yourself at Walmart. Ooh, these rubber bands are colorful. I also want to increase the damage range on this. Oh, that's easy. I can modify the barrel for you. No, no, put a flashlight on it. Flashlight? How does that have anything to do with damage range? I don't know. Don't ask me. That's what Activision came up with. That just doesn't make any sense, but okay. Here's the high-tech gun you wanted. Cool. No, no more sniper scopes. It's not even funny anymore. That joke got old like 15 episodes ago. 